It's beautiful, isn't it? It's just a flower, Sam. See, that's your problem. What problem? I don't have a problem. You don't appreciate the, the smaller things in life. Yeah, well, in the scheme of things, it's all a waste of time, if you ask me. You know, you think too much. And what's wrong with that? It makes you moody. And I, for one, don't like that. Besides, Riley, I'm only here to make you happy. <laughs> well, you're doing a pretty poor job at it. Hey, calm down. It is beautiful. You told me to find a place where your secrets and shame would hide. And in the winter, your branches and leaves would wither and die. You told me. Hey, Dad. Brenda. <clears throat> I made it home in one piece. I'll just make myself dinner then. Before I got back. Hey Riley, what's wrong? That woman's back in our house again. Oh. Miss her. Oh, Riley. I wish I could hold you right now. We're half right family, aren't we? You'll always have me, Riley. You know what? I think I know where I'm going to take you tomorrow. No, uh, not this again. Riley, trust me. I don't care if it 
morning, Riley. Would you like some breakfast? I made some pancakes. I'm not hungry. Nonsense. You must eat something. Breakfast is important for a growing baby. And children who eat their breakfast do better in school. Look, I have to be somewhere. Look, Ryan, you're having some breakfast or you're not leaving this house. Brenda, Riley doesn't want breakfast. Don't you know anything about raising children? The boy needs something to eat. My brother had a friend whose children didn't eat anything for breakfast, and those kids totally were not with it. You need to learn. You need to change. Thanks for bringing me out here, Sam. I really needed this. Sam? What? <laughs> Sorry. I was just thinking. What about? About this place. Do you remember the first time we, time we came out here? It was beautiful. Now it's just overrun by weeds. What do you think happened, Riley? I don't know. I don't come here often. It's peaceful. What's wrong? I can't eat this. Why don't you just eat around it? We ought to get out more often. This is really nice. I guess. Maybe. Hey, Riley? Yeah? What do you think of me? What are you talking about? Well, do you still need me around? It's just that Sometimes... What? Sam, what are you talking about? Do you honestly think I want you gone? Well... I'm just unsure at times. Sam! Don't be silly. You're my best mate. You've gotten me through all the hard times, through all these years. I owe you my sanity. You're perfect. Ah! Oh God, Ben, what the hell is that? Kill it! Oh, oh look, it's a worm. Ah! Just, just kidding, it's only a twig. Dude. It is an earthworm. Get it 
away from here. Kill it. It's not hurting anyone. <laughs> oh, I'll take it somewhere far away. Oh, 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 yucky. Yuck, 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 yuck. Dad. Son, is there anything bothering you? No. You sure? Nothing's going on with you? No. Okay, you sure then? I'm sure. Son, you've been acting kind of strangely lately. It's like you're hiding something from me. Just leave me alone. It's not like you care anyway. Riley? Riley? Riley, where the hell have you been? I could ask you the same thing. Riley, get back here this instant. Riley! Sam, are you there? Of course I am. Are you okay? Who the hell does he think he is? That manipulative, uncaring... Ah! It's okay. Riley, what is this? Nothing. Just leave me alone and get out of my room. You were talking to yourself. What? No, I'm not. Riley, you, you need help, son. Help? So now you care about me? I'm your father. Don't you talk to me like that. There must be some mistake. My father died four years ago. With my mother. I loved your mother. Loved. Stop it! I don't want to hear another word. Right now, I just want to know why you've been talking to yourself. I haven't! You're crazy! Just listen to yourself. I'm taking you to a professional. What? A therapist? I'm fine. Sam, tell him that I'm fine! Who the hell is Sam? He's my boyfriend. Riley, right? listen to yourself! No, Dad, just no! Wake up, son! You're hurting him! Hello, son. Hey, Dad. You're making dinner. That's right. Right, see? Pass me that, will you, Sam? Thanks. Say, Riley, let me... I'm fine! Sam, can you please pass me this banner? Thanks. Can you grab the wrench? My father taught me how to fix my pop. Oh, if you want, you can work on the chain. Um,
Riley? Riley, we need to talk. Don't act like you don't know. It's about us. Ever since your dad. Yeah, Dad, that sounds great, thanks. Riley, listen to me! See, this is what I'm talking about. Ever since Brenda left, it's like... It's like because you've been spending time with Ben, you've forgotten about me. But he's my dad. He neglected you for four years! And me? I was there for you the entire time. I thought you were... But you're dead. My dad can't help being human. He's made some mistakes, sure. But he's changed, Sam. And maybe... Maybe we had a shot at being a real family again. Real? Real? Look at me, Riley! I'm real! Haven't I been here for you for all of these years? Haven't I been the one to help you out? Damn it, Riley! Did you love me at all? Of course. Of course I did. I truly... Oh, you've been so self-centred, Riley. All of these years, I've never asked anything from you. And now, when it comes to something that would mean the world to me, I don't want to lose you to the man I protected you from. Sam, please be reasonable. Four years! And for what, Riley? You tell me! Don't you understand that I've done everything for you? People like Ben don't change. He's just gonna hurt you again. Shut up, Sam! Just shut up and leave me alone! Sam?